Hello, Dane Ash here from Air Gunner UK admin team. Um, we've been given the opportunity today to review the Excalibur Infrared Laser Torch, um, kindly donated to us by Lee Poland of N8 Vision, or Nate Vision, um, thank you Lee. Um, basically, first run through the equipment that we're using in line, we've got the Scope MTC Viper Connect, we've got the uh, Night uh, Sight Viper Artec, and the uh, Range Finder, Night Sight Range Finder. Um, that's what we were using with it, but let's have a little look at that boy. Hit us off. So, the Excalibur IR laser torch. Um, firstly, it needs to be said that this is a phenomenal piece of kit. Um, I couldn't recommend it highly enough. If you're going to spend your hard earned money on a night vision setup, then you need to invest in one of these. Um, it's low weight, it's at 111 grams. Excalibur runs, Excalibur runs on one 18650 battery, uh, which is rechargeable, readily available. Um, we had it on full maximum setting for four and a half hours before it started to dim at 650 yards. So we changed the battery over and the Artec died two minutes later anyway. But previous to the Excalibur, I was always using the T38 LED torch. Now this is a good bit of kit, I recommend it, but in comparison, I won't actually compare it, there is no comparison, but after using that, I wouldn't now refer, wouldn't now go back to this, you just, you just wouldn't, so I'll put that to the side. Um, yeah, to come on back to the Excalibur, it's got three different settings, low, medium and high. Like I said, in the high range setting, you'll see from clips we'll cut away to the tree lines lit up at 650 yards. I mean, it, it really is quite phenomenal how far this thing will go. Close range, uh, 20, 30, 40, 50 yards. No, bother, no worries about light, uh, brought white out or it, uh, the laser um, scaring off rabbits, skitch rabbits, any of that, not a problem whatsoever. It worked perfectly. Um, it does come, you can get accessory kits with it, like the rack towel and the adjustable mount. You see, as I had this mounted onto the front because of the Artec and the various kit, you haven't really got much space to mount it on the side of the scope, etc. So we have to mount it on the front. Um, with the adjustable mounts and so on, you can different scopes, you can mount it elsewhere. And also with the rack towel, you're not leaning to the front of your rifle to change the settings uh, or change the power. Um, as I said, we went around for four and a half hours, five hours on it, on its highest power setting. And yeah, after about the four and a half hour mark, it slightly dimmed at the 600 yards kind of mark. So, it, I mean, it would last you on the medium setting or low setting, it will last all night easily. And you don't need to really be seeing the rabbits at a 600 yards down the bottom of the field. Um, not with the sub 12, not with what I'm using anyway. Um, yeah, not much more I can really say. So, we, here we have some footage of the Excalibur in action. This rabbit is about 60 yards out and you can see quite clearly it's well visible. Um, anything, I mean the tree line behind it is about 90 yards. Then we go on to this rabbit is about 70 yards out. And again, it's clear as day. Uh, the Excalibur just lights up. Anything up to about 150 yards is easily, easily seeable. And beyond that, to be honest, I mean we can see rabbits of 400 yards, which we'll get to in a minute. These, are, these were 140 yards. Again, I mean, you're talking sub 12, so, but anything like live fire FAC, you'd be going for this shot, uh, clear as day, you can't miss it, it really is quite impressive how it lights up, this footage shows you 668 yards, we're pinging that back tree line, the hedge in front of it, it's 400 yards, which we'll come to now, there you go, 405 yards, and that lights it up like a Christmas tree, but the tree line behind it, that was 650 yards and you could see it quite clearly lighting it up I mean it really does impress um, if you've got night scope you need this Excalibur it really does help